Hey guys, welcome back to our video on Mike Nitas. Today we're gonna do another ship bios video. Today we're gonna do the second ship of the Kaiser class. And this ship was the SS Crown Prince Wilhelm. Let's get on with the story, shall we? Crown Prince Wilhelm was the first was the second of four superliners for the uh, for the Nordish Nordister Lloyd um line. One ship had already been built. The the Kaiser Wilhelm de Grasse, which was the name of the Kaiser class. And here is a poster of the Crown Prince Wilhelm and her two, uh, and her three other sister ships. The Kaiser Wil uh, Wilhelm de Grasse, the Crown Prince Wilhelm herself, the Crown Princessin Cecily, uh, and the Kaiser Wilhelm II. As you can see, there were express liners for the German company. Here is a picture of the uh, of the Crown Prince Wilhelm smoking room. Here's the reading room, the first class music room, and the first class dining room, which looks like a, a theater the first time I saw this picture. Yes, sir, the Crown Prince Wilhelm was one of the finest ships of the German line. That was until World War, uh, World War I. In August of 1914, World War One had just begun. There was need for auxiliary cruisers. Just like her sister, Kaiser Wilhelm de Grasse, the Crown Prince Wilhelm was turned into an auxiliary cruiser na named SMS Crown Prince Wilhelm. Here, uh, uh, at this position, she would sink numerous ships. She would sink numerous ships by this, po by this, um, way. She would overrun the, sh the targeted ship by her speed and size. Send a boarding party over, get uh, get the people on board the target ship off the ship, and then sink it. The victims of the Crown Prince Wilhelm were the Highland Beret, Wilfred M, Samantha, and and the Br uh, Britannia, SS Guadeloupe, SS Tamar, SS Colebi, Pitten, SS Chase Hill, SS Indian Prince. SS La Carentina, Union, SS Bellevue, SS Mont Angel, SS Hemisphere, and SS Pataro. Uh, During her 251 days of unspeakable, uh, of unspeakable, um, bruteness, Lieutenant Alfred von Nizachowski, uh, made the book the cruise of the Crown Prince Wilhelm of his experience on board. During this time period, the uh, the Crown Prince Wilhelm will be known as the Mystery Ship. However, after 251 days of raiding, she was interned into a into a port in Portsmouth, Virginia, which she will be interned for the next two years. Then, Crown Prince Wilhelm was turned into a a U.S. troop ship named, uh, renamed USS Von Steuben. Here you can see the Von Steuben be, being escorted by the U, uh, along with other troop ships like the USS Mont Vernon and the USS Armageddon. On June 18th of, of 1917, the ship was attacked, uh, the Von Steuben was uh, attacked by a tor torpedo from the U-151, but it's, uh, but it was able to avoid the torpedo. On December 6, 1917, the ship, w the Von Steuben was heading for Halif Halifax for coal, uh, for coaling duties. Then, there was a massive concussion from an explosion nearby. This was part of the Halifax explosion, which the SS e Emo and the SS Mount Blanc had collided and exploded. 2,000 people were killed, but nobody died on the, uh, on the Von Steuben, just being only, uh, even though being just six miles from the, uh, from the explosion point. Then, in 1919, the war was over, and the Crown, uh, the Crown Prince Will, uh, the, uh, the Von Steuben helped bring, uh, bring, uh, um, Military men from war back to uh, back to their homes, like in this picture in 1919. Instead of being brought back to Germany, the ship was taken into service as a passenger liner for the United States. Still, uh, usually, then she was um, 
uh, named Baron Von Steubing, and then just Von Steubing. Then her name uh, was struck in uh, 1920. Her name disappeared in 1923, and was scrapped the same year. Thank you very much for watching this video of the second ship of the Kajic class, the Crown Prince Wilhelm, n then named the, uh, then renamed Von Steubing. Now we're gonna go. Uh, after this video, we're going to go on to the, se to the third ship of the class, the Kaiser Wilhelm II. Thank you guys for enjoying this video. Have a nice day. This is Megmanita signing out on the story of the SS Crown, uh, Crown Prince Wilhelm.